Um, hello, right, in this video I'm going to show you what's the, the biggest problem with uh, Mass Effect Andromeda under Windows 10 using one GPU and 3D Vision. Uh, this problem is only under Windows 10, Windows 7 doesn't have this problem, so if you have Windows 10 or Windows 7, please stick with it. If you Only if you want to play it under Windows 10, you uh, need this uh, workaround that I'm going to show. But first, let's see how the game normally behaves. So, yeah, we just start the game normally, 2 division is uh, enabled in the NVIDIA control panel. This is uh, recorded on my laptop with um, one GPU and one screen and it's representative of what you get on any type of, uh, on any PC in um, Windows uh, 10 and one GPU. As we can already see, the main page is completely broken, different elements that render, I don't know, mono, stereo, pff, in all sorts of places, so this is a NVIDIA 3D Vision plus Windows 10 problem, so the 3D Vision driver works perfectly fine under Windows 7, so I think it's actually a Microsoft problem which probably will never get solved. So <coughs> now that we've seen how broken it is by default, we exit the game, we go to our location where Mass Effect is installed, then we make a, a, a batch file. Inside the batch file there are two commands. First command will delete the NVIDIA um, shader cache which is in C, users, your username, app, data, local, temp, NVIDIA corporation, NV cache. Uh, and the second command is basically starting the game. So for the sake of simplicity, I have that shortcut here on the desktop, so we're going to use that one now. So now comes the workaround. So we start the game using that shortcut. Wait for the game to start. Once inside we press Alt Enter. We get and we wait for the game to load. As you can see, it's building the shaders. And once we get to the main screen, we Alt Enter again and see, like we see, in one eye is completely black. So we, that's another um, NVIDIA driver problem. We start the game again, take two, using the same shortcut. Uh, <coughs> Now it's already in window mode, so oh. we leave it loading in window mode until we get to the main menu. Let's see now. And as you can see, compared to how things looked previously, everything's fine. So, yeah, you can see one tiny halo here on the right. That's <coughs> because um, the compute shaders, all the lining in this game is uh, based on compute shaders and the compute shaders don't work properly. So the first thing, and this fix will uh, uh, address the game or fixes the game without compute uh, shaders. So in order to disable the compute shaders, we press, we open up the console by pressing the key next to um, key number one on your keyboard and we type world or world, press tab to autocomplete, light press tab to autocomplete CS, press tab to autocomplete path enable zero. And now you can see that thing have um, ha there has gone away. So the workaround, this is part of the workaround. The second part of the workaround is after we get to the main screen, before we load any map, if, uh, disable to division and press alt enter again and we get in window mode again, we select our save either from load game or resume and we start the game and as you can see now it says building shader so this is basically the moment where when the game starts building all its billion and millions and trillions of shaders and for some reason if 3D Vision is enabled at this point it will fail to um, sterilize the shaders. 
so that's why we need to do it in uh, window mode and I saw I don't know if you saw it I don't know if you see it on uh, on the recorded but I saw a, a glitch the whole screen went blank for a couple of seconds there. Our climbing pathfinder. so once we are inside the game we press alt enter again and we are in the game and as you can see the model looks perfectly fine but there, but there is a glitch in one eye so in order to fix this one we press escape we go game and we just load the same save game again and if I'm lucky shadow play will not crash here if I'm unlucky the game will crash now without it's and yeah missing. as you can see everything's fine so, yep, you heard it. The game crashed there, and that's a shadow play problem. Uh, if you don't use shadow play, the game will not crash. So, yeah, this is about the workaround. Um, I'm going to pause the video now, and I'm uh, going to uh, come back with another video where I show you what happens after we load the game the second time and everything looks fine without the game actually crashing it's shadow play that uh, is triggering the crash so be right back